swimming hole has been all covered up with sticky vines. Uh, come on! Uh, uh, whoa! For swimmer, maybe. <laughs> Spike? All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Come fall on me. Here's the time and valleys to roam. Oh, streams to follow. Unstuck. He's stuck, all right. But if Spike's stuck, how he get unstuck? Excuse you, Spike. Oh no! Where did Spike go? In hole. In hole? Hole not good! Maybe he will see the tiny sauruses. No, they live in the caves on the other side of the Great Valley. What if something down there, something scary? Scary? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Spike? Spike! Spike! I do not think Spike heard me because I do not hear Spike. And me not see him either. <laughs> Careful, Petrie. You don't want to fall in too. Fall? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, how is Spike going to get out? I don't know. He's not much of a climber. We're gonna need help. Help is good, but I do not want to leave Spike alone. No, no, no. Then we'll go and you stay. Okay, but please hurry. Um.
Spike and I fell into a hole. I wouldn't want to be Spike. Can't he just dig his way out? No, oh, he need a big head to dig like that. <laughs> well, at least my head isn't small. Yes, but if your head was on Spike, he wouldn't be Spike, and you wouldn't be you. I'm afraid I must concur with Ruby on this issue. Spike does not possess the strong, flat prow of a three-horn nor the long neck of, well, a long neck. So how is Spike gonna get out? Do you think you could help us rescue Spike, Mr. Thicknose? Why, certainly. Just lead the way. <laughs> I'll believe it when I see it. Speaking of it, you're it! <laughs> What is he doing here? And um, why is he eating my bed? <laughs> um, why don't you ask him and find out? I'm not asking him. You ask him. No way. You ask him. I'll ask him. <laughs> <clears throat> Greetings. I am Milo, and these are my friends, Lydia and Plower. Hello. Hello. <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, um, what brings you to our world? Mm -hmm. I don't understand. Maybe you're not supposed to. Huh? Huh? Maybe this stranger who fell from the mysterious above is... the Big Wise One. The Big Wise One? No, he's not. Think about where he came from. Above the mysterious above. Oh, please. The strange white world we've never been to. Legend says our dreams will come true with the big wise one. Huh. Above the mysterious above. Where our visitor has come from. Do you really think I'm so dumb to think that he's the one? His kindly smile, his giant size. The big wise one is here. Just look into his thoughtful eyes. Your doubts will disappear. Above, above the mysterious above. The mysterious above. How we've looked forward to this day. Oh, oh big wise one, one, show us the way. way so we may share your love from the mysterious above. Where are 
are you all going? Mr. Thickno is going to help Spike out of a hole. He is? Well, good luck then. <laughs> Spike will need it. <laughs> I don't find anything funny about a young Spike Tail in trouble. Oh. Come on, Sarah. I better show them how to save Spike. For you, big wise one. <laughs> oh, big wise one, I must know. Why is it that sometimes the ground shakes and shivers? Of course, it is you who makes the ground shake. Oh, oh thank you, big wise one. Oh, big wise one, when will I be ready to leave my parents' nest and forage on my own? I see. I will be ready when my horns are full grown. Thank you, big wise one. <laughs> the big wise one is finally here. Oh, I am so happy you are back. Are you sure he's down there? I saw him fall, but all I have heard is Spike's tummy sounds. Don't worry, Ducky. I'm sure I can think of a way to save Spike. Oh, thinking won't save Spike, but strength will. Now, Mr. Threehorn, in my experience, things like this require careful consideration. Consideration? <laughs> bah! Let's just start digging. But if you dig in the wrong place, we might all end up down there. Are you suggesting that I would dig in the wrong place? Yes, you've got to think. Wrong place? That's right. I don't know any hole that's been dug by thinking. You've got to think. You've got to use strength. No, you've got to think. Strength. Think. Strength. Think. Strength. Oh, think. Me not understand. Strength. Think. They helping Strength. Spike now think. or not? Drink. Think. Doesn't sound Drink. like the sound Think. of Spike Strength. getting out to Think. me. Drink. Think. So how is Spike gonna get out of that hole? Oh, I do not know, but I do hope he is all right. I don't think we should wake him. Oh, what choice do we have? Oh, big wise one. You big wise one? Big wise one! Maybe he's saving his strength. Maybe. Yeah, but the time has come to use that strength. <laughs> Oh, big wise one. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, big wise one. We are sorry for the rude awakening, but it is time. <sighs> Time to vanquish the great hideous beast! The great hideous beast runs on two legs like a fast fighter. Has the helmet of a three-horn. And the big scary eyes of a night walker. <laughs> Thank you for coming from the mysterious above to save us, big wise one. It's all up to you. <laughs> Bye.
speak, wise one. If the ground was soft enough to swallow Spike, we'll need to use rocks to stabilize. No time for that. We need to dig. I don't think it's that simple. Ha! <laughs> you don't know what you're talking about. And you're being stubborn. Well, I wouldn't be if you'd just do things my way. Her <laughs> way, yes. We'll get him out my way, my way. We'll do it my way. Oh, no. My way, my way. We'll do it my way. There can be no doubt that I can get Spike out my way. My way. If you listen to me, he'd already be free. My way. My way. You can't expect me to believe that your idea could really succeed. My way. My way. We'll do it my way. I say my way. No, my way. We'll, we'll do, do it my way. My, my, my way. Did they agree on an idea yet? Me not know. Me too dizzy. Then we'll just have to agree to agree on an idea ourselves. Right. about the sticky vines. They are very long, yep, yep, yep. Not long enough to get all the way down the hole. But they can be even longer by curling one vine with another vine with another vine. Long enough to reach Spike? Spike can just curl the vines around his middle. Then we pull up the vines, and the vines pull up Spike. That's the best idea we've heard all day. Being the big wise one must make you very hungry. <laughs> so we've brought you all the food from our colony. <laughs> You're not getting any this time. <laughs> <laughs> the wise one from above wishes to go back to the mysterious above. from the great hideous beast. It is right that you return to the mysterious above and protect others. Oh. <laughs> hey, where did the great hideous beast go? Spike? No, no, no. I thought he felt lighter. If Spike's not here, then where... Oh, excuse you, Spike. <gasps> Spike? Spike! You back! Yay! Spike! Woohoo! Yes, yes, yes! It doesn't matter 
who that was who was here. What matters is that Spike is the who that is here. And for that, I am glad. Mm. Very glad. If you just listen to me... Why should I? My way's better. But Mr. Thicknose and Mr. Threehorn. Spike's already been saved it. <laughs> well, um, uh, how nice. He would have been rescued earlier if you hadn't argued with me. You're the one who started arguing. I did not. Oh, yes, you did. I did not. Did so. Did not. Did so. Did not. Did not. Did not. Did so. Still, I'm hungry. Hey, everybody! Look what we have! Tree stars! We pick them using our hands. <laughs> They're so handy. Oh, hey! All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Come follow me. Hills to climb and valleys to roam. Oh, streams to follow all the way home. To the land before time. just hiding, you know, until the wind settled down. Hi, Guido. Remember me and Ruby? We met you the last time you babysat Trisha. Chomper, the friendly sharp tooth. <laughs> How could I forget? <laughs> You're still friendly, right? Yep. You still learning to fly? Oh, that. Well, <laughs> being a glider, it is kind of hard to get off the ground without a, a little help. Maybe big blowy wind give you lots of help. See, like whoa, whoa, whoa. But uh, it's really blowy. It'll be okay, Guido. Petrie will help you. Me will. Oh, oh, yes, me will. Well, I really would like to fly. Should have stayed in my stump. You can do it, you good glider. Well, that's really nice of you to say, but and whoa! 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 Wings, Guido! Wings! What? Oh, right! Wings! Whoa! 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 Blowy make you fly good. Yeah, it does kind of, doesn't it? Now, follow me. Follow, he says. It getting too blowy. We done now. Oh, yeah, but I want to... Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, did you see me out there? 
Oh, come on, Petrie, let's do it again. I gotta twist and turn one more time. Oh, come on, Petrie, please, 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 please. <laughs> mm -mm, no, too blowy now. We fly tomorrow. <gasps> tomorrow? But my wings are all warmed up now. No, not safe. I thought blowy was good. You see? It's okay! First, I swoop! Uh, oh, boy. Oh, boy! Whoa! Whoa! What is he doing? Why is he going up so high? Hey, wind! Stop! Whoa! Help! Oh, need better help. We're inside Black Rock. <gasps> Black Rock? Oh, that not good. I know. Mind helping me up? Ugh. Okay. Ow! 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 Wow! Ooh. Ooh! I must have landed funny on my foot. Yes. I. Oh! Ow! Oh, oh. Ow! <laughs> and Mino can fly. Yeah, but at least you can walk. <laughs> See if you can find a way out of here, all right? Uh, okay. Oh, too steep. No climb here. <laughs> Petrie! I saw something move. Over there. Me not see anything. Too dark. And I'm afraid of the dark. I'm afraid of caves, but most of all, I'm afraid of being afraid. Guido, you're more scared than me. Don't be, don't be scared. Don't be, don't be scared. It's easier to say than do. But singing help me know it true. Then I will try to sing with you. And not be scared. Oh, it's awfully dark. Way down here in the black rock. It's very black rock. Maybe it's not so bad if we find an easy way out. 
Hey, let's just find any way out, okay? Do, 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 don't be, don't be scared. Don't be, don't be scared. Pretend that you'll be brave and strong. You know the tune, so sing along. Hope I don't end up being wrong. Not being scared. <laughs> being scared. <laughs> well, Petri, I gotta admit, I'm not as scared as I was. Now I'm more scared! It's all this stupid wind's fault. I just hope they find Petrie and Guido soon. Oh, oh, I can't look. Watch there, tell me. Babe, it's too scary, don't tell me. plant. Well, at least you won't starve. Oh, crawlers! You eat too. You feel better. Hmm. Yeah, uh, not bad for cave crawlies. Uh... Petri? You hungry? <gasps> oh, sorry, Phyllis. My manners ain't what they used to be. I don't get many visitors around here. The name is Swooper. Now, I've lived here for a long, long time, but uh, it ain't so bad, you see. I'm not alone. This here is Cliff. And the tall one over yonder goes by Slim, and then the good looker in the corner, why, that's Aggie. He has been here a long time. <laughs> Why you stay so long? Why? Well, because I'm blind. Oh no! They didn't find them! Petrie's mom looks so tired. We can't just sit here. We gotta do something to help. I hate feeling so helpless. <laughs> Say, maybe we can't help Petrie and Guido, but we can help the helpers. You blind? How you get around? Ooh, well, that's simple. I memorized every last bit of this place. Between hearing and smelling, why, I can figure out exactly where you fellas get to. <laughs> that's also how I can tell you were eating my ground stars. <laughs> Back home in Great Valley, there's so much food. Everybody friends, everybody happy. The Great Valley, hmm. Why, that sounds like the kind of home I've always dreamed about. Cause I, I could never get there. That trip's too risky for a blind old flyer like me. Oh, me wish we'd take you there. Oh, oh but me still no can fly. Guido still hurt and you no see. Oh, we never get back to Great Valley. Yep, 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 yep. If we tried to walk there, a sharp tooth would get us for sure. You know, there might be a way. What if you fly while Petri and I ride on your back? We could be your eyes. Ooh, I don't know. It sounds risky. Mighty risky. I'd have to think long and hard before I'd give that a try. Well, I've made up my mind. I'm sure gonna miss you two. I'm 
heading for the Great Valley with my new friends. <gasps> if you're ever out that way, I'll stop by and visit you here. Fresh air, if you ask me. Home that way. Well, let's get a going. Hop on. Swooper, uh, when exactly was the last time you flew? Oh, let me see now. It was so long ago. Okay, maybe on second thought. We <laughs> Here we go! to flying again, you know. <laughs> now, which way? <sighs> well, uh, okay, uh, point your beak a little left. Oh, 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 wait! Uh, yeah, okay, that's good. That's the fastest way to the valley. No, 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 still too blowy. Fly around, go right, left, right, left, right, left, right! right. Oh, fellas, if we're gonna get anywhere, we gotta work together. Okay, Swooper's right. You've flown more, Petrie. You decide which way. Uh, Guido helped, too. Uh, use your wings. Feel for change in wind. I can do that. Oh, that's better. Especially since I can only go in one direction. <laughs> you some tree stars. We gathered enough for all the flyers. We wanted to help. Thank you all very much. I haven't had much time for food since... Oh, do not be sad. Petrie will come home. He will. He will. I know, little one. They'll both be home just as soon as the wind stops and we can go find them. I just hope they're safe. <sighs> Whew. I haven't flown this long in ages. Once every land so as I can take a load off. We got a problem. I'm not sure how long I can keep going. Well, then Petri fly. Make easy for Swooper. No. Oh, oh, oh. Well, you're not ready to fly, Petri. I guess I'll have to glide for a while. You. you sure? Well, one of us has to get off Swooper's back, and this trip was my idea. <laughs> You can do it, you good glider. You're right. I can do this! Hey, hey, this isn't so bad! I'm gonna check things out up higher! Hey, Swooper! Petri! 
wind's blowing toward the Great Valley. You can rest your wings. Oh, it does these old bones good to soar again. We'll be getting to your valley in no time. <laughs> They've been spotted. They've come back to us. Woohoo! We did it, Swooper! We're home! And we never would have made it without you, Guido. You're hurt. A little. Uh, maybe okay. This Swooper, he flew me home. Thank you so much, Swooper. Glad to do it, ma'am. But the whole idea was Guido's, and he found the wind that helped us get here. We never make it home without wind. Oh, thank you, Guido. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Everyone, let's give Petrie, Guido, and their new, I mean, our new friend, Swooper, a big welcome home. Yeah! <laughs> it's good to be home, all thanks to our new friend. We finally safe now. Our journey is at an end. Take it, Petrie. Shortcut. Hmm. Well, at least I. Hey, look! I think I know that herd. I do too. It's Allie. Allie's come back. Let's go see her. I wish we had a shortcut.
All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. And bright with a newborn sun. Come follow me. Hills to climb and valleys to roam. Oh, streams to follow all the way home. To the land before time. sound very brave. Oh, yeah, Little Nick. My name is Little Foot. Well, I'm Rhett the Brave, hero of the herd, scarer of the sharp teeth. Hero of the herd? <clears throat> scarer of the sharp teeth? The ones we've seen aren't scared of flying rocks, earth shakes, or smoking mountains. Let alone little long necks. Well, they're scared of me. Tell them all about your adventures, Rhett. Well, while you kids have been living here safe all the time, I've been in the mysterious beyond protecting my herd. Stay back. I'll handle this. scared of those flying rocks. Now, another time, the herd was being chased. Go on without me. I won't let them hurt you. That was a close one. <laughs> That's some tail. I know. And then there was the time I used my tail to build a mountain of rocks that the sharp teeth couldn't climb. <laughs> You haven't heard anything yet. I think we've heard enough. We've heard plenty. So, Allie, were you with Rhett when any of this stuff happened? Um, no. That happened before our herds joined up. And you really believe that he built a mountain of rocks with his tail? While being chased by sharp teeth? Oh, well, that mountain of rocks who was mostly built. But I did finish the top. See? He finished the top! Of a mountain? 
That's pretty hard to believe. You're just mad because you can't knock down trees with your tail. Come on, Sarah. I guess we're just not brave enough to play with Allie anymore. <laughs> Want to play rescue? Um, okay. I can't believe Allie believes those crazy stories. We were her friends. Hmm. Well, it's not fair. He can't be her best friend. I don't care. The stories he's telling are phony. Tree. Rhett's making stuff up and has convinced Allie he's telling the truth. Allie thinks he's so brave, and he's not. It makes me so mad. I'm angry, too. Well, the longer you're mad, the less you're happy. So what we do? I don't know, Petrie. But we got to find a way to show Allie the truth. Yeah. I could just try telling Allie that Red is making stuff up again. But what if she does not believe you again? What if Red hit you with tail? <laughs> <laughs> we need to show Allie that Red's not as brave as he says. Yeah, I'd like to see what Red would do if a real sharp tooth came around. Hmm. Wait, what if we really did have him face a real sharp tooth? You want to bring a real sharp tooth into the Great Valley? Uh, I don't know if that plan's such a good plan. My plan is to use a sharp tooth that's already here. <laughs> There's sharp tooth in Great Valley. Ooh. Yep, and he's right here. You mean me? But Chomper is nice. He is, he is. We know Chomper's nice, but you don't know that until you know him. And Allie and Rhett have never met Chomper. Right! Now, here's how it'll work. Ah! Chomper will chase us around, pretending he's a vicious sharp tooth. <laughs> <laughs> Then Littlefoot shows up and asks Rhett to help him save everyone. Grr, grr, grr. Ah, but when Rhett gets scared, Allie will see he's been making up all of those stories. See? If we all pretend right, it'll work. I can pretend to be scared in. Yup, yup, yup. Oh, me good at being scared. <laughs> I'm not sure about this. Come on, Littlefoot. It's a great plan. What can possibly go wrong? What do you think, Chomper? It sounds kind of fun to me. As long as nobody gets hurt. Nobody will get hurt? We're all just going to be pretending. Then it sounds like I'll be pretending to have friends for dinner. Friends for dinner. Pretend to have friends for dinner.
He'll say he wants three horn soup and little foot stew. It might be funny when he chew on you. Mm -hmm. That's not a very nice thing to do. To have friends for dinner. <laughs> friends for dinner. Don't want to be friends for dinner. Don't want to be spike a la mode or flavor of duck. You think that tastes good? Yuck! You know you've run out of luck when you're friends for dinner. Friends for dinner. Friends for dinner. My friends for dinner. Mmm. So, Littlefoot, what do you say now? It probably would show Allie that Red's not so brave. Okay, let's do it. Ready? And go! Come on, guys, you're supposed to be scared. And you're supposed to be scary. <gasps> <laughs> Guys, be serious. Start again. Ah, he hungry, me scared. And I am even more scared it is. We need help to be saved. <laughs> Rush in and stand right next to me, little foot. Let's try it one more time. Ah, he hungry, me scared. And I am even more scared. We need help to be saved! <laughs> Come on, Rhett! Help me save him! Perfect! Now let's go! Time to show Allie what Red is really like! Let's play rescue. Again? Can we play tag instead? Or the pointy seat game? Or swimmer splasher? Rescue it is! Start yelling help! <gasps> you sound different. That wasn't me. That was someone who really needs help. Rescue them, Red! Help! Ah! He hungry! Even more scared it is. We need help to be safe. <laughs> Who's chasing you? Who, who, who's hungry? He is. <laughs> A sharp tooth. What are you waiting for, Red? Save us, Red. We gotta save everyone. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Yourself. Oh, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> um, what's going on? <laughs> we wanted to show you that Rhett wasn't as brave as he said he was, so I came up with this plan. But that shark tooth, where did he come from? Oh, sorry, Allie. Meet Chomper. Hi, Allie. Sorry if I scared you. You're friends with a sharp tooth? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Chomper and Ruby live in the secret caverns. It's kind of a long story. But one thing's for sure. We are not afraid to play with Chomper. So what do you think? Do you want to play with us? 
Well, sure. I guess Red isn't as brave as he says he is. Where'd he go, anyway? Sharp tooth? I've never heard of such a thing. The sharp this tooth can't be that never. Be. He's a sharp tooth! Who cares if he talks? Let's get rid of him! <gasps> I suppose we must. Hold on! Wait! <laughs> <laughs> Chasing you. You were calling for help. They wanted to show me that all of Red's stories were made up. Stories? What stories? Um. He kept telling me that he saved his herd from many sharp teeth before we met them. Red, come forward. Uh, yes. Did you make up stories to fool these children? Um, um, uh, um. It's okay, Rhett. Yes, I did. I'm sorry. Little ones, this is very serious. Did you see what happened when you tried to fool each other? Yes, I guess so. You may have wanted it to be a joke, but a sharp tooth attack is no laughing matter. We're all really sorry, old one. And as for you... Uh, yes? I don't know how you became friends with so many here in the Great Valley. But I think it's good. Long necks, follow me! Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> we can play now. We can. We can. Me not it if we play tag. I'm too tired to be it. Hey, Rhett. Want to play tag? But I made up all my adventures. It doesn't mean we can't all have new adventures. Come on, Rhett. What are you waiting for? Ah, <laughs> uh, you guys are the best. Okay, Spike, you're it. <laughs> 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 